if I'm completely honest, I never thought we'd get here, but we have. Hello there, folks, and welcome to a channel update video because I have reached a thousand subscribers. And the grin on my face, the little grin on my face, does not tell in really any circumstance how happy I am about that because it's a milestone that all YouTubers want to get to. It's the first big milestone. Yes, you've probably got 100 subscribers, fair enough. But a thousand subscribers, especially now with the monetization stuff on YouTube, is the big milestone for all YouTubers to get. I've been doing this a long time. And we finally got there, so that is absolutely fantastic. I thank everyone who has watched one of my videos, everyone who subscribed, everyone who's still here, and everybody who's watching this video now. I just can't quite believe we've got to a thousand subscribers. And unfortunately, over the weekend, I've been so inundated with things to do that have, it hasn't really sunk in yet, and I haven't really computed it. So now is the time to compute it, say thank you to you guys, uh, and talk a little bit about what I'm going to do for a thousand subscribers, because, let's be honest... I didn't think I was going to get here. A few weeks ago, I was already on about 950 subscribers, so I thought that a 1,000 was quite a, quite a while off, but it seems with the likes of the patch video I did for Snooker 19, there's about 20 or 30 of it that came in, and just through natural progression, some of you subscribed. So hello to everyone who's new at the channel. I'm Toby, or TIJ Gavin. I think you gathered that by the, the channel name, but yeah, it's absolutely fantastic to get here to a 1,000 subscribers. A little bit earlier than... Uh, sorry if I'm just getting me lip, because there's something on my lip. And no, it's not lipstick. Anyway, let's talk about what I'm going to do for a 1,000 subscribers. Now, some of you have asked in the comments recently if you can play against me on Snooker 19, which I'm absolutely fine about. But what I thought would be good is to have a live stream. Have a live stream for a few hours where I can talk to you guys, get to know my subscriber base a little bit better, you get to know me a little bit better. Just a chilled, relaxed few hours on YouTube. And potentially I can play some of you at Snooker 19. We can play whatever you guys want to see. And that'll be really good. And we can also have a live Q&A. You can ask me questions uh, while I'm live. And that'll be a real good way to communicate. I'm not quite sure when that's going to happen just yet. But I have, not quite, but hopefully in a few days, got access to this community tab, which allows me to put posts up. And you guys will see them as long as you're on your desktop or phone, I think. I don't think iPads uh, or Android. I don't really know. But I think as long as you're on desktop, the community tab will work. So... Give that a quick check if it is available, um, and I'll be telling you exactly when I know and have confirmed that the live stream is going to take place. But that's definitely something that's going to take place. Uh, we're probably looking probably later this week, maybe Saturday, possibly even Sunday, but I'll let you know when I know about that. What is the next bit? Yes, the next bit. We are going to do an official Q&A. Now, I said I'm going to do a live Q&A on that live stream, but what, I'll, what I have done for a long time is a proper Q&A. So leave your comments down below. It could be about sport, music, life, gaming, anything you want to hear about. And I'll just sift out the rubbish. <laughs> but uh, yeah, uh, leave a comment or comments with your questions. I hope you don't ask 50 questions, but uh, there are certain people, you know who, I, who I've asked several questions on their Q&As who would be entitled to ask more than a few questions. But if you are leaving a question for the Q&A, I would love it if you could use the hashtag Q&A, not Q and A, uh, Q-N-A. So Queen, um, Nero, A? A-C-D-C, -C. yeah, that'll do. Nero, that was a bit rubbish, wasn't it? What world starts with an N? Norris, Lando Norris, that's it. So Queen, Norris, Abba. Works perfectly. So leave uh, hashtag Q&A in the comments if you want to ask a question for that. And that, again, will be out later in the week. Thirdly, uh, we are going to do something that I haven't done for a really long time. But I thought for a 1,000 subscribers, I'll bring it back for a one-off. And you guys can take part as well. I did the F1 quiz back a few years ago, which I'd get two people, usually YouTube content creators, to challenge each other on F1 knowledge. And I really enjoyed doing that. So for the 1,000 subscriber special... I'm going to get two content creators lined up on one team and two viewers on the other team. So if you're interested in that, make sure to leave a comment uh, saying that you'd like to do the F1 quiz. Preferably, I'd love you to leave a contact, so Twitter, Skype, Discord, just so I can get in touch with you outside of YouTube to uh, discuss when we're going to do this F1 quiz. But it might be one content creator and one viewer on a team or both content creators. I haven't quite decided yet, but I know exactly which content creators I'm going to poach for that. So that'll be a lot of fun. Uh, and that might be a few weeks away, yeah. I want to spread these uh, celebrations out just a little bit. But I thought I'd do that. It's something a little bit different. And if you are interested, let me know down below. It's just going to be probably be about a half an hour recording session. Basically a question of sport, but just Formula 1. So if you're into that sort of thing and want to test your Formula 1 knowledge, leave a comment down below. And then finally what we're going to do for a 1,000 subs is one that actually I, I'd quite like to do for myself more than anything. And just 
have a look and track things. I'm going to talk about in a long video, a lengthy video, uh, sat in front of the webcam and the computer, how I got here. So my YouTube journey so far, because some of you might have subscribed yesterday, some of you might have been around with me since I started making content at the start of 2012. You know, that's a big, that's a massive difference, especially in my life. I was only 11 then. Sorry, YouTube, I was a little bit underage. But, uh, yeah, I'm 18 now, and obviously that's a huge, huge scope. Uh, and on that video, I'll be showing you my old channel, uh, this channel, which is effectively the new channel still, if we talk about the old channel. So that'll be a lot of it, very interesting to make, and I hope you guys enjoy that as well. And I think for my personal benefit, it'll go, wow, I really, really don't remember this, or it seems like yesterday. So a bit of a nostalgia trip for me. But that is the celebration I'm going to do for a thousand subscribers. Thank you all so much for getting me to that milestone. I'm absolutely chuffed. Uh, and just a few other things. This is a channel update video. I'm just going to talk about a few other things that are changing with the channel. If we do get this community tab, I won't have to do these so often. I'll be able to put a lot of the changes I'm making in the community tab. Or like yesterday, for example, on Bank Holiday Monday, when it was a bit confusing and we only had Ashes. That was purely because I've been busy all weekend, sat down to do a snooker video yesterday, and then, oh, by the way, you've got to go out all day. Oh, right, we can't do that. And luckily, because I released the Ben Stokes video on Sunday, which hopefully you guys enjoyed that as well, just something a little bit different and spontaneous, I released the Ashes video late, which meant that that come out on Monday as a substitute for Snooker. So what we're going to talk about quickly is a new schedule. Now, MotoGP has gone from the channel for a few weeks. That's not going to be returning anytime soon, but we are going to be introducing a new series to the channel. So we're going to have to wriggle a few things about a little bit for that to fit. So hopefully there's going to be a graphic on the right hand side above me uh, which will display more visually what the new schedule is going to be. So on a Monday we are going to have Snooker 19 as we have done for a long time. You guys really seem to enjoy the Snooker content on the channel and that's really what's got me to this milestone. So I can't drop that. We are going to have three Snooker videos a week. So on Mondays we're going to have Snooker 19. That's also going to go for Wednesdays and for Saturdays. On those days we're just going to have Snooker. Those are Snooker exclusive days. No more videos on those days. That's your days that you can catch snooker on the channel. Three videos a week, three matches a week, unless they're longer matches, obviously. And I will also uh, say that in the latest Snooker 19 video as well. So if you guys forget, then I can, uh, you can always check back on that and make sure that you do remember. Secondly, we have two days of the same on Tuesday and on Friday. We have Ashes at 8pm. We have Ashes at 8pm also on, on Friday, uh, Tuesday and Friday, sorry. Uh, and we'll also ask you on a Sunday at 8pm. So three videos of that as well on different days to um, Snooker 19. It was originally Tuesday, Thursday and Saturday. But since we've now got Snooker on a Saturday, I don't want to put both on the same day. I wouldn't see much point in that. I need to just clog up the schedule a little bit. So Tuesday, Thursday and uh, Sunday is when you're going to find your Ashes content. That obviously is a series that won't last forever. But given the, uh, the, the Ashes and how quick that seems to be going at the moment... We're not going to get that finished by the end of the Ashes series, but there's not really much problem with that. Uh, you guys seem to still be enjoying it. And the new series on the channel, we're going to have a retro Let's Play. I have, still haven't decided what that's going to be just yet. I'd maybe give me a few ideas down in the comments. I've got a few games lined up, but not quite sure what to play yet. So next week is when this schedule all starts. So you've got till Monday to give your suggestions for games that we can play. So that schedule up there, uh, and also we'll pop a proper retro Sunday in there as well when I can do one. That is going to be the new schedule for the next few weeks at least. If it chops and changes, then hopefully you can understand. And hopefully, again, we can put that in the community tab. And also, on my About page on the channel, uh, it should be the most up-to-date schedule, even though it's still got MotoGP in it at the moment. So I'll have to change that as soon as I've done this video. But because that comes into effect next week, and because of a few confusions we've had, a few confusions, a few delays we've had this week with content, uh, we have got just to make sure that you guys understand the schedule for this week. So today, tonight at 8pm, because this is coming out at actually, no, I'll bring this out at 4. So at 6, we're going to have Ashes. Uh, Wednesday, so tomorrow, Snooker will be back in action. Thursday, it's not going to be a video. That might be perhaps time for the YouTube journey video, possibly. Friday, Ashes is back again. Then Saturday, Snooker. And then Sunday, if I can get a retro Sunday out, and also an Ashes video. So that's what it's going to be for this week. But if we just navigate over to the other schedule, that's what it will be. Uh, the week after. I've really given myself a lot of editing to do here, which is really, really annoying. One or two more things. Well, particularly for the new viewers, I do have two other channels. I have a music channel and an education channel. The music channel, where I talk about things like this, like ACDC, uh, album reviews, top tens, all that sort of thing. That's a channel I really need to start creating content for now. And 
if we can get some new subscribers over there, that'd be absolutely fantastic. Uh, so that channel, we'll probably, I'll probably put it in the end screen and also put it in the description if you want to go and see that. But you can search for the music channel by TIJ Music and the education channel, if you hadn't guessed already, by TIJ Education, which will just produce educational content. So if you want to see that, go and visit that channel. And just one more thing. I did finish my exams at the start of June. The 12th of June I finished. Now, we are coming to the end of August. So in the next few weeks, I will be returning to some form of work, university, whatever it is. Unfortunately, still haven't got anything decided yet. But there are a few things in the pipeline. So when I know, I'll let you guys know. Uh, and in the next few weeks, I should be going back uh, to a full-time... I guess we can say a full-time job, but let's just say uni's a job, shall we? Well, basically a full-time commitment. I think that's a bit of a better way to phrase it. So we shouldn't really see much in the way of interruption with videos. I'm still happy to produce what I'm producing at the moment. But once I go back to a commitment full time, if there is the odd video that doesn't come out on one day, I do apologise, but it's just the way it is sometimes life does get a little bit ahead. But the point of this video was to say a big thumbs up for a thousand subscribers. Absolutely fantastic milestone. I am absolutely chuffed. And hopefully we can build from here. We've got some new games coming in at the end of the year. We've got Grid coming out, which I'm looking to play. We've got Football Manager 2020, which I'm going to do a few little series on. And there might be a few other games that come up, the less popular games, the stuff like Snooker 19 that you guys have absolutely loved on the channel. If there's anything like that, I don't know when this is Snooker is coming out by Stephen Hendry. I might pick that up at some point. But my point is we're going to have a bit bigger range of games at the end of the year. As soon as Ashes finishes, we'll have the Retro Let's Play and Snooker on the channel. But of course that leaves uh, open another option for a new series. So we're going to have a lot of different series up to Christmas, just experimenting with stuff. Uh, and hopefully you guys will enjoy them. So, a few things to recap. Live stream for a 1,000 subscribers, live Q&A, an, an official Q&A, which will be a proper video, and you can leave your um, comments down below for the Q&A with the hashtag Queen Norris ACDC, but Q&A, don't put Queen Norris ACDC, please, because <laughs> that would be really confusing to sieve through. F1 quiz, if you're interested in that, leave it down in the comments, and also a video later in the week about my YouTube journey. And just quickly... Schedule this week, schedule next week. That's going to be a pain in the backside to edit, but hopefully I should get it an absolute, absolutely fine. And also, go and visit my music and educational channels if you're interested in those. And also, just a reminder, I'm going to be back to a full-time commitment in a few weeks. So, thank you very much for watching, folks. I'll be back with content as quickly as tonight with the Ashes 09 series uh, continuing. And then we've got Snooker 19 coming back tomorrow. And next week, we have the introduction of a retro Let's Play. You'll have to see what that is on Tuesday night at 6pm. But apart from that, that is all I've got to say. Again, can't thank you guys enough for a thousand subscribers. Absolutely fantastic. Thank you for watching, and I'll see you guys on the other side. Goodbye for now.